Hey everybody, what's up? It's me, Rook. I am here in Phoenix, Arizona on my way to Dallas, Mexico. Okay, I have a load. I believe we have, uh, oops. I'm in my, um, 48-foot Reaper trader, and I'm in my Peterbilt. Oh yeah. So let's get started, people. I don't want to hold this up. Again, welcome. Let's uh, get ready. Let's release them brakes, and we are on our way. Oh yeah, here we go. Take this out of here without a scratch, or shall I say, without a hitch. I'm excited to be on this uh, trip here. This is my new reefer. This is one of them. I bought a, uh, a fleet of them. I got them spread out to all my garages throughout the United States. So, this was my own personal. So, can anybody use this but me in my trucks? Take the right turn ahead. Okay, be taking the right turn. All right. Turn right. Let me turn these off. I, I don't need my overheads or my uh, mercy flashers on. You know, I like leaving this time of morning. Let me, let me show you what time of morning it is. Okay. Okay. Let's look at this down here too as well. At the bottom of the screen, our cargo is fruits, and it's like twenty-nine thousand nine hundred and six pounds. Destination is Gallup. Mexico, that's Walmart. Okay, our expected time is on a Thursday between the hours of 11 17 a.m. all the way up to 5 57 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Now, the income, uh, y'all getting a little personal there. Let me get rid of that screen because you guys are looking. Now, as you can see, the time is like 4 04 in the morning. I like leaving around about this time. But the traffic is light in. I get to uh, see the sunset come up, so that's one of the reasons why I like to leave early. As you can see, the sun is trying to come up uh, to our left. You see the light is getting, um, it's taking over the sky, so as we drive, we can see. Now, let me jump back inside the cab so I can turn perfect if I can, because I'm looking for them cookies from you guys. Hit the like button when you see me turn real good. Let's look to our left. All right, no one's coming, and let's make the turn. That's a good turn there, because somebody gave me a cookie. Hit that like button, you guys. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Like button, cookie, cookie, like button, same thing. Give me say, buy me a cookie, that means hit that like button. So, buy me a cookie. Yeah, the sun's starting to come up now. You, you can see, uh, the light is losing to the to the day. Well, the night is losing to the day. The night is losing to the light. Well, my God, messed that up. Let me hear my bright lights. You yeah, slow her down. Slow her down. You excited to have the reaper? Really? Well, you excited to have these guys ride a long shotgun with you on your trip? I don't know. Any given group. That's a rest stop on our right and left. We don't need that. You see traffic is starting to pick up now. The game will add more traffic as uh, it gets later in the day. When I was driving here, it was virtually no traffic, period. Because it was pitch dark. It was like 12 midnight when I got here. Game time. Now it's almost five o'clock, so yeah. The world is waking up. Our people in the home sleep. You got truck drivers out there moving the world, you know. Commerce, produce. You know, the only things that we need to survive. Okay. 
Okay, Phoenix City Limits. We'll be taking the 17 over to the uh, uh, Flagstaff Interchange, which we will switch over to the 40, I believe. Continue straight. Uh, okay, Tucson, Los Angeles, okay, Buckhead. Or was that Backhead? Blackhead, I, I couldn't see. I am going a little fast, so. Los Angeles a half a mile. No, we're not going there. We're going to uh, Gallup, New Mexico. I really enjoy driving this truck. Um, it's becoming one of my favorites. So, the description is going to be in the title so but it is a Peter Bill I think it's a five Continue straight. a 568 I think it's, well, it's, it's in a 500 series it has 600 horsepower the torque on this thing is like a 2050 you know it can handle load so yeah it drives pretty nice, I gotta say. That's why I like it, you know. As I said, it's, it's, it's uh, become one of my favorite vehicles to drive in this game. There's the sunlight, people. There we go. You know, you hear people say, drive into the sunset. You know, I like to drive with the sunrise. Drive into the Right. Yeah. We get over to the sky, uh, merge in. We get right back over there. I'm going to try to stay out that uh, fast lane to our left. You know? I have a tendency to ride that lane. And I don't think that's in the trucker's handbook, guys. But. I'm not a trucker. <laughs> I'm more or less of a gamer playing a trucker's game, but I'm not a trucker. No, no, sorry. I don't think I can do this in real life. Okay, as I say, we are on the 17, headed our way towards the uh, the 40, the 40. Mexico. Nice little uh, spaghetti turn right here. I give you turn my own names. So if you hear me call something that's that's unorthodox, then that's just me giving it my own little touch. So ah, don't pay attention to it. You know what? I want to go outside so you guys can see some of this. How about that, guys, huh? Did you guys see some of this here? Uh-oh, what up? I'm not a very good outside driver yet. I haven't mastered that craft, so... Okay, Camp Verde, one mile. Uh, it's not our destination, Camp Verde. Got a rest area with gas, phone, all that. No, no, no. I'm bobbing and weaving all over the road. Continue Trying to straight. keep it straight in. Read these signs. They go Camp Brady. We don't want that. I apologize for my uh, wacky driving on the outside, but I, like I said, duck! I, I'm not that good when it comes to the outside driving. If I can get my vision set this right, then I'll be okay. Like right now, I think I'm all right. Yeah, that is a cookie. Okay, there's a river bed right down there. Continue straight. Okay, Middle Birdie Road. Middle Birdie in Mount. Okay, all right. They got a birdie thing going on here. Ready to duck, duck. All right, there you go. 
hope you guys are enjoying the um, sightseeing. I'm, I'm trying to like get it tight in so you guys can get a better feel and vision and view and all that good stuff as long as you can see it. I know I can see the sun rays shining through these uh, trees. You guys see that? Kind of blinding, but nice to look at if you can uh, bear to watch it. The pastor can enjoy, not the driver. Uh, okay, that's a nice turn there, guys. I think they deserve a cookie. Hit that like button, guys. Uh, speed limit 65, not on this turn. No, no, no. You know, I, I passed through this section right here many times, and I just enjoyed this. Thing. You know what? Uh, I just enjoyed this little view right here, guys. Yeah, I, I like that. Call me weird, I don't know. But I like that. Yeah. Okay, moving on. Put our blinkers on, let them know that we want to get back over. Let's get our outside mirrors. He's letting me over. Thank you, guy. Thank you, guy. Dismiss the blinker, and we are rolling back. There's the rock textures on our right. I enjoy when I come through this way. Yeah, you would think I would want to be a meteorologist or something. You know, all these, all these rocks I'm looking at and just admire the textures on them. You know? Well, in the game, actually. I like how they take out the detail of time. Yeah, look at that on our left. Look at these rocks here, guys. You bring some realism to this, you know what I mean? If you couldn't enjoy it too much on the inside of the cap, that's why I came outside so you guys can see. All right, we got Albuquerque in Los Angeles, two miles, 40 interstate. That's what we want. That is what we want, from the 17 to the 40. Grand Canyon. Oh, you guys got to see the Grand Canyon on this thing. It's wonderful. But, call me weird. We are in the state of Arizona as we speak. We just passed that marker, right? This can just turn nice, but tight. Slow it down. All right. Use the right lane and take the exit on the right. Oh yes, we will. Now we're going to the 40 take the east. Exit on the right. The 40 east Albuquerque, that New Mexico. But we are going to Gallup, not Albuquerque. This truck handles really nice, guys. Really nice. Some of you might say, it's just a game. No, every truck drives different. Um, well, you know, the physics on them, the physics on them is different, you know. Some of them you have to adjust and play with the physics, but, uh, some of them you can just drive right off the lot and they have to be just nice. Like this, I'd have to do nothing to it really. It just show off what it got. It got power and it show off power. It has a nice uh, 
it has nice steering and handling. Wrap the back. I have to change nothing on this truck, really. What you hear now is the gate brake. You see, this sounds so nice. And I am weaving all over the road. Here we go. Alright, let's turn back inside for a minute because this is just uh, wasteland. Like, up. Uh, this is Mr. Blinker. And now to hit a jake break. Look at that jake break. Whoa. Engine break. Jake break, same thing. They just call it different things. But it, a jake break is basically the engine break. I guess some guy named Jake invented it. I don't know. I don't know his true thing. E cycle, people. E cycle. The sign says E cycle. Uh, 75 the mile speed limit, so let's uh, increase that. There's a state trooper to make sure I don't go past that. So I'll set my uh, cruise control so I cannot get a ticket. Right along, it's 
74. I'm gonna hold that speed because that's a safe speed. That's one under the speed limit, which is 75. If I get a ticket now, something wrong. We are continuing straight. Albuquerque East, 40 East, we are still in round. Do I turn here or do 
no, yeah, I go up here and turn. I'm sorry. Okay, there we go. The interest is up here. Alrighty, I got you, 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 I got you. Use your, use your turn, fella. Alright. Yes, we did. Safely, with no accidents, no nothing. How about that? Turn around hazards to let them know that we are here. That the traffic outside can just wait. want this puppy in the back probably oh uh, yeah they want it right back there so what I can do if I'm allowed no I don't think I'm allowed to go to my right I would have uh, came around to the right I would have came around either this no I couldn't turn that way because of the trailer uh, this is the only route right here and you turn it around and you back her in because I was I, I would have went this way came around and then back it in but anyway let's 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 see what we gonna do I'm spontaneous you know oh I can't go that way oh I have to go all right what's behind me waiting nobody good I didn't hold up traffic I did not hold up traffic. That is wonderful. Mm -hmm. Now it's time for us to turn on our overheads. Because we are on their property. And for insurance purposes. Uh, we got to be highly visible. As far as you know, our ambers overheads and our mercy flashers and stuff, it has to be on. This way, um, you're covered liable, you know. You're going by the rules. The maze coming through here. Here's the maze. All right, made that. No problems there. I could just bet now. Nah. They're not gonna make this easy. I see that now. All right. Okay. They're not gonna make this easy. Watch that truck. Watch that truck. Okay. No. All right. There's an Ashley furniture right there, and also the U-Haul truck. Let's not get that in the meat on the CA. Who is this, Mr. UPS right here? No, nope, that's so. That's just a, just a regular old work utility service truck. Okay, with some piping on top. Take it, he's a plumber. While the ice cream man is here, I have Mr. Frosty. I have no idea. Most delicious. Shakes, cones, sundaes, soft serve. Alright. This only took like 30 minutes. Alright, here's the trouble right here. Here's the trouble right here. What I need to do is really jackknife this. I think I'm gonna I'm jackknife it. Yeah, I'm gonna jackknife it. Jackknife, jackknife, jackknife. Anybody got a sharp blade I can use? I think I'm about to cut somebody. Cut something. Get this in there. Okay. Looking good. 
looking good. Okay. And look at this right here in front of me, guys. This trailer in front of me. That is my trailer that I designed just last night. Wow. That is one of my trailers I designed last night, which belongs to uh, the name I have on there is um, FLS Logistics. That's the name of the company. I didn't have a uh, logo, so uh, what I did is I uh, I went into my files, my photo files, and I took a picture of one of my trucks with the uh, low boy on it. And it was right there by the Grand Canyon, right, right there. So I just snapped the picture and I used that for the side of my trailer. And, and there you have my trailer right there. Wow. Ran into my own trailer. Well, not run into it, but you know, finally saw one on the first day that I, I put them out. Because it, it was this morning. It was late this morning early this morning then I went to bed but uh one of my trader guys I'm impressed now my very first mod ever very first mod Now that just uh, encourages me to make more. Okay, what did we do wrong? Oh, okay. There's a, yeah, you can't go through that. No. You were so fascinated by your trailer until, oh, don't hit your trailer. Until you just uh, messed up that uh, part. Let's try it like this. Look at me backing up fast like I'm an expert truck driver. Just give it gas like I know it's supposed to. Not. Trust you me, I'm not done. what I'm learning, so. Yeah, messed this one up too. Let's bring her forward a little bit. It kind of let it line itself up. Give it a little help. Yeah, there you go. Don't hit my trailer, guy. There we go. There we go. That is better. Jump inside so I can see my work. All right. Bring it back. And this is right on the line, guys. This is right on the line. There you go. She's in there, people. Mercy break. Take a look outside. Oh, yeah, that is... Yeah. They bought it. I'm selling it. I shut her down and tell them to take this job and what? Pay me. All right, here go the breakdown. All right, all right. Our time is even good. Look at our time right there. Well, you guys can't see the time. I can see the time. It is 35 minutes and 7 seconds and counting. Okay, we did an excellent job. Of course, uh, our fruits delivered from Phoenix to Gallup. 
Driving distance is 379 miles. Time taken 8 hours and 49 minutes. 52 gallons of fuel was consumed. Okay, they gave me 102,600 and $24 for the um, base reward of the 379 miles experience points I have 610 for that category proficiency bonus I never get no experience points so it's never there so it's at level 37 and we get additional $37,748 added on to that okay Long distance delivery bonus skill rank number six. They gave us a $5,101. Experience points is 152 extra points to go along with that 610. Trailer maneuvering bonus never, 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 never no cash. Never no cash. But I did get 105 experience points, and I don't know why I should get more, but uh, I'm not going to question that. I'm, I'm just glad this is here. It's over, and you guys have had the experience to riding with my Peterbilt. Matter of fact, you know what? This is a Peterbilt 567. Did I say that earlier? Yeah, Ultra Cab Sleeper. Okay, uh, it has a 6x4 chassis. The cabin is Ultra Cab Sleeper, of course. Uh, the steering is left hand because it is US. If it was European, it'd have been on the right hand side. Okay, the engine power, like I said, is 600 horsepower. The torque on that thing, like I said, is 2050. All right, the gearbox is an Eden 18 speed with the retarder. All right, the gas tank is 271 gallons. And this is the stat on the reefer, which is the uh, trailer. Uh, it's a single type trailer, it's refrigerated. Um, these are the body length, internal, body width, internal, body height, internal, the tear weight. Uh, it is um, 15,480 pounds. That's how much this whole trailer weighs. Okay, the axle is two. You got it there, one and two. All right. Liftable axle, no. Sting axle, no. Total length, 48 feet all right now you got the stats on that and i am done and all i want to say to you guys is thank you for your time i want to see you guys on the next video if you have not subscribed already now is the time to do so go ahead and make sure that you activate that all bell so you get the notifications when i come out with new videos any kind of blog any kind of comments any kind of whatever contest i want to do contests but you guys got to support me i need i need subscribers tell a friend if you like what you see pass it along pass the buck chuck anyway with that given and said i'm gonna say thank you again and this is my fade out picture let's get rid of everything oh no 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 let's go back outside Let's go back outside and let's lose these. There you go. That's what I want you guys to see. I'm going to leave you with that. Until next time, people. I'll see you guys. Y'all be safe. Wear your mask. Wash your hands constantly, people. And practice social distancing. Thank you very much. God bless. See you next time. Grump out.